In today's video, we're going to learn some key vocabulary and phrases that you'll need to play board games in Chinese. 今天我们要来学一些玩桌游的时候会用到的中文 Don't forget to go check out Scritter.com It's one of the most powerful tools for learning Chinese and Japanese characters. Set up. Let's start with 骰子 Shaizi. Most Shaizi. board games have shaizi. Shaizi. Um <laughs> One more time. Shaizi. Shaizi. How many times can we say shaizi? <laughs> shaizi. <laughs> you guys get the point. The word for dice is shaizi. <laughs> but I don't know what I looked up in the dictionary. <laughs> A few moments later. But when I looked up in the dictionary, Anna, it said tozi. 因為這其實頭子才是正確的念法,但是實際上沒有人在講頭子,大部分都是講骰子,所以如果你在學中文的話,不要講頭子,講骰子大家才聽得懂。Yes, so the correct pronunciation for the character is actually tou, but most commonly it will be pronounced as shaizi. And what's the verb for chucking out dice? 就是骰,所以我們會講骰骰子。Can you say tou shaizi? We got it. Toll is more like this, unless the game requires you to do this. But shy is more like. Many board games will also come with cards. And how do we say that in Chinese, Anna? 卡片或是卡牌。so to recap, you can say 卡片, 卡牌, 牌卡卡. All right. As the term board game suggests, usually there is a board, a 板子 of some mm -hmm. sort. This is set list of Catan, so you would put it together, but I would call it probably a 板子. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. When we start playing a board game, what we usually have to do is first read the instructions. So how do we say that? Literally the booklet to make clear. Mm -hmm. um, what we're trying to look for is usually the rules of the game. Mm. So if I was playing a new board game with Iona, I might say, Iona, can you and that's when you don't play board games with this type of person. <laughs> now, as we're setting up um, the board game, you might finally ask, is there anything else that I need to prepare? In which case you would say, 我们还需要准备什么呢? Do we, what, what else do we need to prepare? And if you're all ready to go, then we start the game. Round one, fight! A lot of board games will have cards, so I think it's important to learn some key card phrases. Um, maybe uh, once you start the game, you need to shuffle your cards. To wash the cards, literally. So one more time. Maybe I'm the dealer and I need to deal out some cards. 发牌 发牌发给别人 Okay, so then maybe um, I need to, let's say, take from a deck 抽牌 抽牌 to draw 抽牌. Um, And maybe if you're just getting one from the top, what would you say? 拿牌 拿牌 If I'm handing out a card, it's my turn And I'm going to put the card down, what would I say? 出牌 Chupai. So let's do a quick recap. Remember, we're washing the cards. Xi pai. We're dealing the cards. Fa pai. Maybe you're drawing a card. Chou pai. Or you are taking one from the top. Na pai. And finally, I'm handing one out to the girl. Chou pai. Now that we've got our card phrases down, I think let's learn some phrases that you might need during the game. Mm -hmm. um, I think a handy one to learn when someone is peering. 不要偷看,看什么看,你没有牌吗? <laughs> 偷看,别偷看我的牌. And if someone's sneaking a, like a, a glance at your cards, would you call them a cheat? 你作弊. <laughs> 你作弊. And this term 作弊 can also be used for, let's say, cheating in an exam. So you mm -hmm. can say, oh, 
。哎呦呢，你都作弊，我哪有作弊？ Another important phrase to learn is "It's your turn." I'm sure we've all been there where it gets to the point where it's like, "Huh?" First of all, 换谁了？换谁了 ？Whose turn is it? 换谁了 ？And then if it's your turn, you would say, 换你了。换你了 ？Or 换我了？换他了 ？It's your turn, my turn, their turn.、Mm. Depending on the game, you might have a final winner or loser. In which case, if you're the winner and you say, "I've won," 我赢了，我赢了，我赢了 <laughs> And then if you've lost, 我输了 Maybe you would say the person that won had good luck. 你手气真好，手气真好 or 运气真好 The difference being that 手气 hand luck is usually more applicable to games where maybe you're like. You know, you're drawing from something, right? Something to do with your hands, but luck overall is just 运气 And if you have bad luck, what would you say? 手气很差，手气很差 And let's end this section with one more phrase. It means once you've put your token down, don't touch the board again. 下好离手。下好离手 Once you've put your whatever token down, put your hand away because you'll find people with itchy hands. 不要后悔<笑>玩游戏，下好离手，不要后悔。下好离手 Once you've placed your token, remove your hand and don't regret your move. Of course, every board game is different, but that's your opportunity to engage with your Chinese-speaking friend and ask them, 这个怎么说？这个怎么玩 ？And get them to teach you the rules of the game. There are four reasons why board games are great for learning Chinese. Number one, you get tons of repetition. You will 一直重复各种不同的词汇 Number two, it's super fun. You know, having fun is a really important element in learning a language. Number three, it's social. You're actually talking with people. You'll be like, "Ah, you 作弊，哪有你拿牌 It's a great way to practice common everyday phrases. And finally, you get real communication. So this is language in a particular context, which helps language learners. But it's genuine communication. 你真的在跟你在一起玩桌游的人沟通。大家记得要去 scritter.com 看我们整个完整的词汇清单。Go to scritter.com to check out the full vocabulary list. Also, check out Hacking Chinese for the blog that inspired this video. We'll see you next time. And until then, good luck with the board games. 加油，祝你好运，希望你手气很好。<laughs> What's with the imaginary part, Anna? <laughs>